Hello friends and welcome to my channel. Here I make book related videos. So if you are interested in books, do subscribe to my channel and do not forget to hit the bell icon so that you get notified every time I post a new video. In today's video, I am going to review The Far Field by Madhuri Vijay. Winner of the JCB Prize for Literature 2019, The Far Field is a remarkable debut novel by the author Madhuri Vijay. I was particularly keen to read this book as it is set in Kashmir. In spite of this being her debut book, the author Madhuri Vijay wins over the readers with her beautiful narration. It is almost lyrical and yet simple enough for even the beginners to enjoy the story. The Far Field follows the story of Shalini, a young privileged woman from Bangalore who is grieving after her mother's death. She remembers a charming salesman Bashir Ahmed who used to frequent her home when she was a child. His infrequent, unannounced visits used to fill their home with stories from Kashmir, laughter and life. And then one day, Bashir Ahmed disappears from their lives and never returns. Certain that the loss of her mother is somehow connected with the decade-long disappearance of Bashir Ahmed, Shalini is determined to confront him. And so, she journeys from a comfortable home in Bangalore to a remote mountainous village in Kashmir. Finally, she is able to trace Bashir's family, but she finds herself entangled in the tragic past of the family. As she seeks to unravel the events leading to her mother's death, she makes some terrible choices which could destroy the very people she had come to love. With beautiful and elegant prose, the author remarkably invokes the sights and sounds of each location in vivid detail. Be it the bustling streets of Bangalore, the tense atmosphere in Kishtwar, or the remote mountain village with spectacular views, all come alive in the author's attention to detail. The setting in Kashmir and the inherent political strife and tensions catalyze the events and bring the readers face to face with the grim realities of the terror hit Kashmir. If I talk about characters, I neither like Shalini's mother nor Shalini. Shalini's mother is rude, audacious, selfish and erratic who lives in her own cocoon. Though she loves her daughter, but she is least bothered how her unpredictable behavior is affecting the little girl. Shalini is also a bit psychologically imbalanced, selfish and immature whose hasty decisions have disastrous consequences. Almost every character, be it Shalini, Shalini's mother, Riaz, Zoya, Khadija Begum, seem to be emotionally distant. And this makes the book a chilly read. Perhaps the Kashmiri characters were intentionally portrayed this way. Their outward reserve and weariness of outsiders could be attributed to their living in an area which is marked by decades-long conflict and violence. The character which really stands out is the vivacious Amina, a Kashmiri villager whose hospitality towards Shalini spells doom for her family. Shalini's journey is a coming of age story, the story of a woman searching for personal identity in a place caught up in political turmoil. The author has done marvelous job in creating atmosphere and ambience. The novel is at its best while describing the beauty and loss in Kashmir. The sections that focus on Shalini's time in Kishtwar and later the remote mountain village in Kashmir are the best in the book. This is indeed an astonishing debut. Madhuri Vijay's narration is gorgeous and evocative. Her theme is intriguing and setting epic. The characters are complex and multi-layered with complicated histories. Her writing is extremely powerful. The only thing that I didn't like about the book is the way the army has been negatively portrayed. There are always two sides of a coin. The author has beautifully brought out the pain and anguish of the Kashmiri people. But in the process, she has branded the army as villain, which is not fair. This is the kind of book that slowly creeps upon you and stays. The end is quite chilling and comes as a shock. The novel is slow paced, but it has lots to offer. The story of love, loss, grief and betrayal is profound and heartbreaking. It is hard to believe that it is a debut novel. I would have given this story a 5 star rating, but due to its poor portrayal of army, I will give this book 4 stars. Have you read this book? If yes, do share your thoughts in the comment section. And if you have liked this video, please like, comment and share. And if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, please do subscribe. Until my next video, 
बाय एंड टेक केयर